What not have happened for me, if not for the confidence, Boski had from the very first meeting she had with me at Gulzahar in terms of how I was doing the music of Aks. And Gulzahar Uncle came up and told me, someone would like to meet you. And he introduced uh, Boski to me, said, This is my daughter. And she just said, Whenever I do my first film, will you compose music for me? Now, that's very important uh, why I'm saying this is in the right here. Because you all know that this is her first film, and she's made a very, very sensitive film. The very fact that she wanted Anu Malik, she knew from the very beginning that I know his melodic and emotional side, and she explored it to the fullest. In fact, someone asked me today, what do you think of Pilar's music? The answer I could prob uh, probably just, that came into my mind was that I never knew I had this kind of melody, this kind of emotions in me. It needed someone like Boski to take it out, and I would also compliment Gozara too for writing such beautiful lyrics, and my singers especially. Like any Sonu is here, Parash is here, and of course Rubji and every other gang, KK, Chidraji, and Jaspender, everyone has worked so hard, and uh, probably Jamuji also, who has had so much faith in the project right from day one. I would like to say a very big thank you to Boski. Honestly, thank you very much for having such confidence.
آئی نو انگلش ویری ویل لیکن فی الحال میں یہ اردو میں بات کرنے لگا بات کہاں سے شروع کروں یہ تو مشکل ہے اگر بہت ذاتی اور نجی بات کروں تو دوستی کی پیدائش سے بات کرنی پڑتی ہے جب شروع میں کہا شروع ہی شاعری اس کے ساتھ کی تھی بٹو رانی بوس کی بون گری ہے اس کی اور اس حصے میں میرے ساتھ راکھی بھی شامل ہیں ان وہ یہاں پر ہیں اور یہ پوس کی بوند انہوں نے میری حتیلی پہ دی تھی نرسری پوئمز لکھتے 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 مجھے اس کی فلم کے ایک دن گانے لکھنے پڑھیں گے یہ نہیں مانتا That's a long journey and which I think is a very very interesting journey تو پوس کی اس بوند سے لے کے یہاں تک لکھنا یہاں تک آنا جہاں یہ کہوں لے چلیں ڈولیوں میں تمہیں گھر ارادہ کرو اور انگلیوں میں پہن دو یہ رشتہ ایک وعدہ کرو یہاں تک آئے ہیں ایک لمبا رستہ ہے یہ تو بڑی نیجی سی بات ہے اس کے علاوہ سارے گاما جسے میں ایچ ایم بی کے نام سے بھی رشتہ چلا آیا رشتہ چلا آیا اور آپ سارے گاما بدل دیئے پھر سارے گاما سے شروع کرو یہ رشتہ میرا مجھے یہ شک تھا کہ نہیں یہ نہ ہو کہ ایچ ایم بی کا حصہ کار دیا جائے اور کہیں کہ اب سارے گاموں سے شروع کرو اب یہ تمہاری پہلی فلم ہے اور سچ پوچھئے تو میری پہلی فلم ہے میری ماں کے ساتھ جس طرح سے اس نے مجھے گانے لکھوائے ہیں کئی دفعہ رد کیا ہے لائنے غلط تھے ہیں وہ ہٹا دیا یہ گانا تھے اس سے کر دیا ہے کر دیا میں نے بہت یقین کے ساتھ تو نہیں کہہ سکتا کہ وہ اگلی فلم میں بھی مجھے مجھے گانے لکھوائے گی لیکن میرا خیال ہے اس کے پاس چارہ کوئی نہیں جب تک وہ ہندی اور اردو میں لکھنا نہیں شروع کر دیتی شاعری نہیں شروع کر دیتی سکرین پر وہ لکھنے لگے ڈائلوگ لکھنے لگے شاعری کا کیا ہو وہاں کچھ بس پر آنا ہی پڑے گا اس امید کا ہوں کہ چلو دوسری فلم ایک فلم میری پہلی فلم سے گزری شاید دوسری بھی ملے ایک شخص کا ذکر کیے بغیر میں یہاں نہیں رہ سکتا جس پر بہت بڑی ظلمواری ہوتی ہے ماں باپ پر جب ان کے بچے زندگی میں قدم رکھتے ہیں اور وہ ظلمواری اس وقت یہ اپنا آپ نہتہ لگتا ہے کمزور لگتا ہے کم لگتا ہے اگر آپ اس میں آپ مدد نہ کر پائیں اگر آپ انہیں کوئی بورڈ نہ دے سکیں جہاں سے وہ پورٹ سکیں جہاں سے وہ تیراتی شروع کر سکیں تو کہیں کمی محسوس ہوتی ہے کہ ہم نے اتنے برس کیا کیا وہ جو آدھی صدی میں کام کر کے آیا تھا تھوڑا سو مجبور محسوس کر رہا تھا and that is where one man came to my hand that is Jammu Sogan and I am very good and I am not very good and I am not very good and I am not very good but for him I don't have seen this happy day and I thank him and thank all of you thank you okay she's a powerhouse of a performer She's going to take you by storm with a performance in Philhal. Please give a very warm welcome to Sushmita Singh.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is truly a very special night, incredibly special. I don't remember when this journey for Philhal began. I have no recollections of our appointments and meeting Meghna and all of those wonderful things. What I do remember is a girl called Meghna Gozar who came up and showed me the one thing most people in this industry lack, conviction. Tremendous conviction. She came up with a script which she shot as perfectly as she had narrated it, scene by scene, shot by shot. She has turned her dream into a reality beautifully. I'm extremely proud of her. Ladies and gentlemen, she's made a lovely, excellent film. I know it's kind of early and I could sound very biased because I'm a part of the film, but absolutely brilliant. I know there's, there's just a lot of people to thank for this film to happen, Mr. Jennison and right here. H. Gozar Sahib, Anu Malik, Manji, so many people, but uh, my co-stars. But most importantly, tonight is a night for Meghna Gozar. Truly um, a very special young lady. Someone who at every point in moment has said, Sushmita, Pata, I don't want Sushmita. I don't want that girl. I want Sia. Give me Sia. And whatever I have done in this film, has literally been me chorored out of me by Meghna to the best of her ability. Tremendous job, everyone in this film has put in their best. Uh, Tabu has given an incredible performance. She's a fantastic actress, and when I started working with her in this film, I makeup makeup and I was the expression striker. The first expression that I had to give with, the first shot that I had to give with Tabu, I really rehearsed it really, really hard. And then she made me so comfortable on the sets that it just became a dream working with this film. Polly, Sanjay Suri, all of them are not only great actors, but lovely human beings. It's been a pleasure working with all of you. And before we all start crying here, I gotta go. Thank you very much for listening, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, he is the new bright shining star on the Hindi film horizon. He's a great human being, at least, He's the best I've known, one of the best for sure. I never thought a day will come where I'll have to stand there and invite him. He'll be the star. This is really upsetting, but I take personal, really personal pleasure inviting him, a dear friend, Sanjay Suri. Thank you very much. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Allah Hawkins. Well, uh, Lots of seniors here, um, the junior most, and uh, thank you everybody. Thank you Mr. Jamu Sugan and uh, Meghna Gulzar for having uh, the conviction in the new camera and to be put up against, uh, like Sushmita said, he, in front of Tabu, she had to rehearse about 10 times. I would maybe <laughs> the night before or a month before, but anyway, it's, it's been a pleasure working with uh, everybody here. And I'd like to thank Jitesh Pillay who introduced me to Meghna Gulzar. And uh, he was, uh, I think, uh, must have been an influencing factor also. But then the Meghna's conviction uh, did it all. And it's been a pleasure working with uh, Palaf Sen as well. The music is brilliant. And uh, it's the music release uh, today, about a year ago, Philhal was actually a dream. And uh, the only, I mean, now it's a reality. And the title, I really believe in the title because uh, life is only in the present past is gone, its future is yet to be seen. So whatever it is, it's for the moment. Thank you. Dr. Pelash Sen, the rocker. He created Euphoria with his music and he's gonna do the same with this movie as an actor. Please give him a very, very warm welcome to make his debut as an actor. Are you going to say a few words or are you going to sing? <laughs> I'll speak. Namaskar everyone. Good evening gentlemen. Good evening. I am Palash Singh from the band Euphoria. And I thought all I was supposed to do all these years was to sing. Until this beautiful happening happened with me. And one day a girl called Meghna Gulzar called up. I didn't recognize Meghna but definitely Gulzar. The man... Uh, <laughs> what? That's true. <laughs> uh, 
the man I've always idolized as a writer. I've copied him, I've worshipped him. The man who knows how to write every word that we can ever think of. I'm blessed that she chose me for the film. In fact, my first question to her at that time was that we have Tabu and Sushmita in the film who are about 5 feet 10 inches. <laughs> um, are you making a film about Kaliber and Lilliput? Uh, where I'm supposed to be in Lilliput. <laughs> and my other thought was maybe I'm being paired opposite Sanjay because we are the same height. <laughs> but, uh, well, she's, but she, she said, no, that's not the case. We are giving some reverse hormones to Sushmita to get her a little shorter than what she is. But then she was fooling me. She didn't do all that. They gave me two boulders to wear throughout the film. And every time I was going to fall off, they were just running to catch me. In fact, I'll just tell you one thing very interesting. It's the only romantic film ever made where a hero, that is Palash, they never gets to hug his heroine. Because uh, to hug her, I would have needed a ladder or maybe I don't know. <laughs> so I, I cut that, all that crap. Uh, I'm a very blessed person. I've, I, I am the first person in a very long time who's going to be in Sonu's here, but I'm also going to be one of the people who's going to be acting and singing the film that I'm acting in. And singing for a person like Anu Malik, who is a god when it comes to melody, and Guzal Saab being directed by Meghna, being produced in a film by uh, Janu Sugan, acting with Tabu and Sush, and being great pals with Sanjay, who all have taught me a lot. My first dialogue in the film was, the film is about living a lifetime in a moment, or maybe living every moment like a life. Filhal is my Thank you. Thank you. You know, I'm really happy with this little talk, but I'm a little upset because the organizers told me not to do what I do on TV and be sweet, be sharp. But after the last little talk here, I mean, this was not fair. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'd like to, to ask Mr. Harish Tiani to invite Mr. Uh, Anu Malik and Gujar Saab to take the music off. Say hi. Okay, I've been told there's another change. <laughs> I forgot to call the director because I thought we were supposed to call her later and make this whole impact. But I'd like to tell you, this person definitely reminds me of my headmistress in school, Mrs. Jogendra, who was very tough, really honestly, who was really tough on me all the time. I mean, look at this. I've been made to wear this shirt to match with the Philal set. <laughs> so I tell you, do not mess with her. His eyes saw my film better than even I could. I really miss him and I wish that he's thinking of us right now because we're definitely thinking about him too. <laughs> my cast, uh, Tabu, it was uh, presumptuous of me to take it as a given that she would do my film any which way, but she has said so in so many interviews that she would do it no matter what and that means a lot to me. Sushmita for agreeing to do it in a blink. Uh, Sanjay agreeing to do it in a blink. Uh, leaving aside the fact that I was a woman director and there were two powerhouse women already in the film. <coughs> <laughs> and 
tall, of course, which of course Palash has complained about, but uh, he has a whole lot of other good points, so we won't get into that one. They've been a dream team to work with. Um, it's very strange when you're working with people who are so established in their fields and you're just starting out and you don't know whether you're doing the right thing or not, whether your vision, your thinking is clear or correct. <coughs> and they listen to you and they agree with you and they respect you and they don't condescend you. It just means so much that your first few footsteps st stand on firm ground. Uh, one of the first people who I actually took on officially in Philhal was uh, Anand Malik. Um, and he was so patient with me. I mean, tunes were fought over, rejected, broken into pieces, mukra from somewhere, antra from somewhere else. But uh, he stood by it all. <coughs> I thought I didn't have much to say, but I'm going on and on and on. But I guess now is the moment when you say all your thanks. And I hope I haven't left anybody out. Chandan, you prefer him to stand in a corner, but I want to let you know that you have been an immense source of strength and support. That's Chandan Arora, my editor always behind the scenes. <laughs> but uh, Vedavi, my choreographer, Radhu Khan, was not here. And all of you who have turned up here with such enthusiasm and so much warmth to welcome me into my career and into this industry, which I believe once you enter is very difficult to go away from. And I think with a night like this to begin with, I'm not going anywhere for a really long time. Thank you. Well, you're not disappearing, you're going to come back because I'd like you to call upon Mr. Anu Malik and Guzar Saab to unveil the music of Pilha. Anu, Guzar Saab. take center stage, but he's doing this for me and it means so much, Mr. Jamo Sudan. Sonu, your voice is part of the music. Please join us. Please. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Sonu Nigam also on the stage. Sit down. There are a lot of people over here to see. Can you please sit down? OK. 
Okay. We can clap again because now we finally made everybody sit down for you for the launch of the runway. Ah. Please welcome Mr. Raki Goda. Chitra, can you come up on stage, please? Please, can you give up? <laughs> and switch off your cameras and all the equipment and not take any pictures. I'd like to request everybody with video cameras to please switch them off and turn your lenses away from the screen because I don't want anything of my film to go out in a way that is not supervised by me. This is the headmistress and me taking a walk. Uh, I'd really appreciate your cooperation if you could please turn your cameras off and turn the lenses around. Thank you so much. You gotta work. The press and the media is here, so I'm sure they have a lot of questions for you. And we will request you to please welcome the question. I know I'm being cursed right now, but I'm sorry. Look at the headmistress. She's sitting next to you. All right, thank you very much and good night. I think it's quite as deep as I am and it's as uh, strong as I am, not all, but almost I can say. I can, I didn't have a lot of trouble identifying with the character I'm playing here and um, very mature uh, character. She's not frivolous, she's not childish and uh, yeah, you can't say much about it. Working for a, with a woman director, you know, what different sensibilities and feelings and how did you find it? Well, for me, see, the relationship was entirely different. It's not just, it was not just a female director. It was also Boski, who I've known personally. She's a kid sister to me. So for me, it was more like that, you know. I was more concerned about uh, her and uh, whether she's all right and whether everything is going on well in the film. So I felt part of the, uh, you know, uh, I, I myself felt like a maker. Uh, and uh, I think, I guess, it's little more, the comfort level is little more if also you're working with a female director. There's more you can discuss uh, with them. There's more you can, you, they can relate to you and your uh, approach or your perspective much more easily rather than a male director. But I mean, it's just that because uh, suddenly there's a crop of female directors that we are talking about it. Otherwise, we are so used to the culture of working with male directors that I don't even find any uh, 
major difference or anything like that. But I'm used to working with male directors most of the time. So it's, but with her it was like working with a friend, with a sister to me. You work with a good bunch of directors, films. Now here with his uh, daughter's films. Are you find any type of influence uh, she was uh, she uh, in her direction style? Was she influenced by his father? Well, see, she has grown up seeing good cinema, and she has grown up in a family where there has been good cinema. Gulzar Sahab has made sensible and sensitive films. So definitely. She is a very sensitive filmmaker. Her understanding of uh, relationships and moments in on cinema is very, very uh, novel, and it's uh, very uh, encouraging to see such interpretation of characters and of relationships. But of course, she is uh, a, another generation from her father altogether. They are t two different people, and they are two different individuals. So as people, they are very different. But definitely. The common factor is good cinema and uh, sensible filmmaking. Tabu, the element of surrogate motherhood, how is it protected? I'm not speaking about that right now. Excuse me, I can't speak. Excuse me.
बारे में कहानी के बारे में तो मैं ज़्यादा डिस्क्लोज नहीं कर सकता लेकिन फिल्म है दोस्ती पर रिलेशनशिप्स पर शादी पर शादी के एक्सपीरियंस पर हमारे कुछ ऐसे डिसीजंस पर जो हमारी लाइफ और सारी खुशी जिस पर निर्भर हो जाती है डिसीजन तो हम ले लेते हैं लेकिन उसके बाद उसके क्या रिज़ल्ट होता है वो उस पर कैसे हम रिएक्ट करते हैं उन हादसों को संभालते संभालते फिलहाल बने फिलहाल का टाइटल फिलहाल क्योंकि लाइफ अभी आप फिलहाल मुझसे सवाल पूछ रहे मैं फिलहाल आपको जवाब दे रहा हूँ तो इसीलिए फॉर द मोमेंट क्योंकि अब जो डिसीजन लेते हैं वो अब अभी के लिए लेते हैं सोचते हैं ये फ्यूचर का डिसीजन है अब नौकरी भी करने जाएंगे अभी आपने डिसाइड कर लिया नौकरी कर रहे हैं बाद में नौकरी में क्या होता है वो आपके हाथ में नहीं है सो मैनी टाइम्स इन लाइफ यू जस्ट डिसाइड टेक अ डिसीजन फॉर द मोमेंट एंड बाद में क्या होता है इट्स नॉट ऑन आर सो द सोल इज़ इन द टाइटल ये गुलजार साहब की फिल्म नहीं है ये मेघना गुलजार की फिल्म है तो पहली बार पहली फिल्म है उनके एज निर्देशक और बहुत मज़ा आया काम करके बहुत डिटेल में काम किया मेघना ने और अच्छा लगता है एक माइल स्टोन सेट कर दिया है बाकी न्यू डायरेक्टर्स के लिए कि क्योंकि मैं अब किसी दूसरी शूटिंग पर जाता हूँ तो मैं ये सोचता हूँ कि आपने अपना होमवर्क किया है मैं एक्सपेक्ट करता हूँ उतना काम किया होगा मेघना ने बहुत डिटेल में काम किया एंड आई विश ऑल द बेस्ट म्यूज़िक आप सुन रहे हैं हम म्यूज़िक लॉन्च पर मेलोडियस है और यूज एज अ नरेटिव इन द फिल्म एक अगर आप गाने मिस कर देंगे तो शायद आप थोड़ी बहुत कहानी भी मिस कर देंगे क्योंकि हर कहा हर गाने में एक कहानी दिखाई देती है आपको और फिल्म को आगे बढ़ाता है म्यूजिक थैंक यू वेरी मच थैंक यू हैप्पी न्यू ईयर पूरी की तरफ से दिवाली की शुभकामनाएं मेरी क्रिसमस टू ऑल ऑफ यू एन अ वेरी हैप्पी एन अ प्रॉस्पेस न्यू ईयर थैंक यू सबसे अच्छी बात इस रोल की यही लगी कि मुझे एक म्यूजिशियन के हिसाब से नहीं देखा जा रहा था 
और एक आइटम के हिसाब से नहीं देखा जाता था एक चरित्र एक कैरेक्टर के हिसाब से देखा जाता था और सबसे अनबिलीवेबल बात इस फिल्म इस फिल्म की और इस कैरेक्टर की ये थी कि इट्स इज सो बिलीवेबल एंड दैट इज़ वाई आई थिंक आई डिड द फिल्म विद सो मच ऑफ हैप्पीनेस एंड सो मच ऑफ इंथुसियाजम बिकॉज मैं चाहता था कि मैं इस तरह का कुछ करूँ और मैं लकी हूँ कि मैंने इस तरह की मुझे फिल्म मिली और मैंने किया बहुत ही अच्छे आदमी का कैरेक्टर है बहुत ही सेंसिटिव है बहुत ही सेंसिबल है बहुत ही ऑनेस्ट है पेशेंट है वो सब कुछ है जो कि मैं रियल लाइफ में नहीं हूँ और मैं होना भी नहीं चाहता हूँ बट ऐसा ऐसा कैरेक्टर है जो कि शायद हर लड़की को चाहिए ज़िंदगी में और इसी तरह का आदमी चाहिए उसको ज़िंदगी में तो वही हूँ मैं इस फिल्म में मेघना के साथ काम करना बिल्कुल ऐसा लगा जैसे मैं अपनी माँ के साथ काम कर रहा हूँ बिकॉज वो मुझे बहुत डांटती है और इतना ज़्यादा डांटती है कि बहुत बार मैंने उसको सेट पे माँ भी बुलाया <laughs> तो बट शी इज़ अ वेरी नाइस गर्ल वेरी सेंसिटिव वेरी इंटेलिजेंट एंड बहुत ही सच्ची फिल्म बनाई है अच्छी फिल्म बनाई है साफ़ सुथरी फिल्म बनाई है और आई एम प्राउड कि आई एम असोसिएटेड विद फिल्म लाइक दिस एक्सलेंट एक्सलेंट म्यूजिक माइंड ब्लोइंग म्यूजिक इट्स वेरी गुड एंड बिकॉज आई एम म्यूजिशियन माई सेल्फ आई थिंक यू शूड टेक माई वर्ड मोर सीरियसली बिकॉज आई एम ऑल म्यूजिशियंस वेरी कम्पेटेटिव बट आई वो स्टिल तेल यू कि इतना अच्छा म्यूजिक मैंने मैंने कभी नहीं सुना बहुत अच्छा म्यूजिक किसको किसके ओके ओके आप सबको दिवाली की शुभकामनाएँ नया साल आप खुशी के साथ धैर्य के साथ अमन के साथ बिताएँ और खुशहाली फैलाएँ वेल यूफोरियाज नेक्स्ट एल्बम इज ड्यू इन जनवरी हम लोग टी सीरीज के साथ भी साइंड अपू एल्बम विल बी आउट इन जनवरी दैट इज़ माई नेक्स्ट प्रोजेक्ट आई डोंट नो इफ एनी बड़ी विल बी स्टूपेड इनफ टू साइन मी फॉर नाउ फिल्म सो आई एम नॉट डूंग फिल्म इन नाउ डिपेंड करता है मैंने जैसे बोला कोई अगर बेवकूफ़ मुझे साइन करेगा नहीं अगर इस तरह की फिल्म फिर से आई जो कि अच्छी भी है और सेंसिटिव है और जिस तरह का मैं म्यूज़िक बनाना चाहता हूँ और जिस तरह की मैं गाने बनाता हूँ उसी के एक्सटेंशन की फिल्म हो आई विल डेफिनेटली डू इट Uh, I'm not sure because she was an assistant to Saeed Mirza for a long time. Then she went to uh, a New York Institute for learn film to learn filmmaking. Then she came back, assisted Saeed Mirza once again. She was chief assistant with him in the scene. Then she worked for two films with me. So it's not necessarily that it has to be my influence. And then she has been watching cinema. She has to grow independently. And uh, I think that's what she has done. And talking about the music of the film, uh, you you had a very strong rapport with R. D. Burman, the one composed, uh, you know, uh, in memory of the film. So, so how, how has it been working with uh, Mr. Anumal? Working with Mr. Anumal. With Anu Malik, I had done three films before. This is the fourth <coughs> film. Yeah, I'm aware of that. But it, it, it's a pleasure. It's, it's a pleasure working with him because there is an inherent sense of a taste or a feel, feel or a flavor of uh, melody in him, which everybody knows. Okay, let's let's Thank call you. it. Jee. Sir, 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 sir. 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 बड़ा अच्छा फील हो रहा है प्राउड फील हो रहा है नर्वस फील हो रहा है हमें तो ओके बहुत अच्छा फील हो क्या सोचा था आपने क्या आपने सोचा कुछ नहीं इट इज द स्क्रिप्ट द स्क्रिप्ट टेल्स यू व्हाट टू राइट इट इज द स्क्रिप्ट द सॉन्ग यू हैव टू राइट व्हाट इज द सॉन्ग रिक्वायर्ड फॉर द स्क्रिप्ट One doesn't have to think separate. Um, that's what I did. Sirji, uh, not as a father, as a viewer, yeah, as a relative. क्या आपने फिल्म देखी होगी? तो कैसा लगा आपको बिसी का काम? बहुत अच्छा लगा. हाँ, बहुत अच्छा लगा. Okay.
एक मिनट कमलेश कमलेश एक मिनट आराम से आराम से लेके आ जाओ मैं बोलूंगी मेरी बारी इस फिल्म का नाम फिलहाल है और मेरे कैरेक्टर का नाम सिया एक ऐसी फिल्म है फिलहाल जिसमें हर रिश्ता कुछ रिश्ते ऐसे जिनके नाम होते हैं और कुछ रिश्ते ऐसे जो बेनाम होते हैं हर एक रिश्ते को ज़िंदगी के दौर से गुजरते हुए शूट किया गया है इट्स अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल मिक्सचर ऑफ मोमेंट्स दैट इफ वन मिस इज इन अ लाइफ टाइम यू सॉर्ट ऑफ मिस दैट वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट डिफाइनिंग मोमेंट ऑफ योर लाइफ मेघना जी के साथ काम करते हुए कैसा कैसा रहा हो बताइए मेघना गुलजार इज सच अ टैलेंटेड एक्ट डायरेक्टर इन इन्होंने मेरे साथ जब पहली मीटिंग की थी तो मुझे एक स्क्रिप्ट दिया था फ़िलहाल के नाम से और मैं आपको मतलब ये इतनी बड़ी बात है कि आज के तारीख में एक नए डायरेक्टर ने एक एक पन्ने पर एक एक डायलॉग उसी तरीके से स्क्रीन पर उतारा है जिस तरह से लिखा गया था कोई चीज़ नहीं बदली गई है स्क्रिप्ट के बारे में इट्स इट्स अ फैबुलस अचीवमेंट मेघना गुलजार इज़ अ वेरी टैलेंटेड डायरेक्टर इस फिल्म में जैसे आपका अभी तक जैसे बहुत सा चुलबुला सा रोल किया है आपने तो इस फिल्म में क्या सीरियस रोल भी किया है आपने या फिर मैं इस फिल्म में आपको रुलाऊंगी भी हंसाऊंगी भी मगर खुद बहुत कम रोई हूँ लेकिन आप रोएंगे अच्छा ये फिलहाल जो फिल्म का नाम रखा गया है इसका क्या मीनिंग है इस फिल्म में हम लोग इतने आगे की सोचते हैं ज़िंदगी में कि कल क्या होगा परसों क्या होगा दस साल बाद क्या होगा मैं जब बिल्कुल बुढ़ी हो जाऊंगी तो क्या करूंगी? इस पूरे दौर में इंसान आज का ये पल जीना भूल जाता है तो इस फिल्म के लिए फ़िलहाल से अच्छा नाम हो ही नहीं सकता था क्योंकि इस फिल्म में हम बात करते हैं उस पल की जो अभी है जो गुजर जो गुजरा नहीं है जो कल नहीं आएगा आज का ये पल फिलहाल का ये मतलब अच्छा तबू जी के साथ काम करते हुए और बाकी अपने तबू संजय सूरी पलाश सेन सब के सब इतने बढ़िया कल, कलाकार हैं इतने अच्छे लोग हैं कि कोई भी एक्टर ऐसे आ, अच्छे एक्टर्स के साथ काम करते वक्त इतना एंजॉय करता है और अपनी परफॉर्मेंस का लेवल भी इतना ऊपर आ जाता है कि फिल्म में आ, जो म्यूज़िक है वो फिल्म की तरह है बहुत सेंसिटिव म्यूज़िक है क्योंकि फिल्म भी बहुत सेंसिटिव है इसमें आपको आइटम सॉन्ग्स नहीं मिलेंगे इसमें आपको वही मिलेगा जो फिल्म के दौर को आगे बढ़ाता है कोई पॉजेज नहीं है फिल्म में और ऑफ़ कोर्स मेरा फेवरेट गाना फ़िलहाल है जो कि टाइटल फिल्म है और आपने वो गाना आज देखा नहीं यहाँ पर तो हम आपको बाद में दिखाएँगे एक्सक्यूज़ मी and have fireworks bursting everywhere uh film industry mein aane ke baad har diwali pe uh ko celebrate karne ka mauka to nahi milta but it's always a festival i look forward to uh, i love uh, the festival of lights we'll have a wonderful diwali have a very happy and prosperous diwali and be extremely safe thank you thank you this is sweet just like thanks yeah abhi yeah abhi ho gaya na abhi ho gaya abhi chaliye ja rahe hain विशिंग ऑल ऑफ यू अ वेरी वेरी हैप्पी एंड प्रॉस्परस दिवाली टेक केयर एंड एंजॉय योर सेल्फ थैंक यू